What's going on guys? Welcome to my channel. In this video I have for you another money glitch. Yes, another money glitch. Two videos in one. But yeah, from here guys, it is quite simple to do this awesome money glitch. You simply need to have a nightclub and the nightclub service entrance. Um, garage B2 and a B3. Okay, but you don't need to have a car. To duplicate okay so if you don't have the EC if you don't have any Benny's vehicle but you have the nightclub and you want to do the money glitches this is your chance because ultimately with this glitch you will be able to make enough money to purchase you know a more expensive vehicle and in the end do the best money glitches in Grand Theft Auto Online okay but as you guys know, very soon, as soon as I hit 15,000 subscribers, I'm gonna give Red Dead Redemption 2. And as you guys know, Red Dead Redemption 2 is back on track. Nice missions, some simple heist. It's only the beginning. This summer it's gonna be awesome. So make sure to be part of this awesome giveaway. And it is very simple. If you want to be part of the giveaway, you simply need to drop a comment. Let me know you want to be part of the giveaway. Ultimately subscribe to my channel, turn the post notifications on to never miss out on any other money glitches, you know, and then you will be part of the giveaway. And please guys, drop a like, so drop a like right about now. So for the first step, you need to go to your nightclub and go to your elevator and select basement level 3. And then you want your friend to start a solo session, okay? Not an invite only session, not a crew session, a solo session, okay? This is the last option uh, you have when you want to launch an online session. So as you can see, my friend is in a solo session. From here, you, your friend needs to go online and basically uh, go to jobs and start a stunt race okay you simply need to go ahead and start a stunt race and from here he needs to wait on this screen okay and you you need to basically go to the elevator door then you want to simply join your friend okay so you join your friend but if you're on Xbox one make sure to not spam a to join your friend okay because you will not have time to select the basement level 2 you will get the GTA session details right away and it's not gonna work okay so now I'm about to show you exactly how to do the glitch okay so you go ahead and you join your friend once again okay so you join your friend but make sure to select join game only one time back out from there and then you want to wait a few seconds five seconds ultimately and then you want to select the basement level 2 you will get this alert right after and then you want to accept the first alert and wait on the second alert for about 15 to 20 seconds remember your friend needs to be in this mission all this time all the time you do this thing inside your arena your friend needs to be on the job so now go ahead and accept this alert screen and you will be stuck on a black screen for a few seconds. If you don't get this black screen just try again. Okay, but at some point you will spawn back inside basement level 2 without your minimap. If you have the minimap at this point just start the glitch over again. But from here if you got all that get inside any car you have in your nightclub basement level 2 and drive it out and once you're outside it's very important guys your friend needs to leave the mission okay it's very important if your friend don't leave the mission you will not be able to proceed with the next steps okay now go ahead and invite your friend to the session so once your friend is in the session he needs to come inside your vehicle then you want to drive to the purple circle and then you want to hover over basement level 2 
and your friend needs to open his interaction menu and select kill yourself and then he wants to quickly press the pause button and go to the xbox store from here guys it is very important your friend needs to wait on the xbox store on the shark cards the entire time so go ahead from here and select basement level 2 and if you did everything correctly you will be completely frozen okay you will be stuck on a black screen and at some point you need to kill yourself okay so i just selected basement level 2 as you can see i am on a black screen completely frozen so now i need to open my interaction menu and select kill yourself there we go so now i'm gonna spawn somewhat close to my nightclub now you want to get inside, okay? You want to get inside a street car. You can use any street car, don't get me wrong, but if you want to make a lot of money very fast, you need to use this car, okay? <laughs> I was so lucky, like, I passed out, boom, spawned back on the map, and the car, the best car to use to do this glitch is right beside me. <laughs> Alright, that's pretty funny, I'm very pleased. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna put in the description the best vehicles to use. Um, this one is the best, I think. But there's also the Sentinel XS, okay? This is a little car, you can find this car very close from the Eclipse Tower, you know? Um, but yeah, it is pretty easy to find the right car, okay? Don't get me wrong again, but from here guys, you need to make your way to Los Santos Customs and remember at this point you don't have the minimap, so you need to know where is Los Santos Customs. I really hope you know where it is. Alright, so from here guys, get inside Los Santos Customs and once you're inside Los Santos Customs with your Obermacca Oracle... Damn, I like the name of this car. But yeah, from here guys, once you're inside Los Santos Customs, you can simply go ahead and repair the vehicle. Then you want to fully customize the vehicle. It's very important if you want to make a lot of money, so fully customize the vehicle. And then you want to go to this section and you want to add a tracker. It is only $2,000, so go ahead and add a tracker on your vehicle. And then you want to exit Los Santos Customs. And once you're outside, um, if you go back in Los Santos Customs, you will be able to add another tracker on this vehicle. Okay, so the way it works, the vehicle will be transferred to the first empty slot you have in your list okay so for me it is for garage number three so make sure you have a couple of empty slots okay before you start to do this glitch um, but as you can see i still have the option to add a tracker so if you do this in fact every time you add a tracker on the vehicle you will get one vehicle so you can get in fact one vehicle every uh, five seconds okay because every time you drive in Los Santos customs and you add another tracker you have one more dupe okay so it is extremely fast but be careful with this glitch guys um, in some other videos I saw about this glitch or about this method or about previous methods with street cars um, the plate the plate guys the plate um there's it's the same plate you know on the on, on all the vehicles uh, so you need to have custom plates so make sure you put a custom plate on your vehicle before you sell the vehicle and make sure to respect the daily sell limit so basically you can use this glitch like i said before to make a good amount of money and purchase a better car to dupe and by the way this glitch works with any car so you can also duplicate personal vehicles with this glitch i made a video about it so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if it is the case don't forget to subscribe to my channel turn the post notifications on thanks for watching guys and have a great day